in this video I am going to show the solution of this problem where uh, we have to write a simple if construct and we have to read a student ID and his GPA out of 4 then uh, the script should display a message according to the following if the GPA is greater than or equal to 3.5 then the message will be excellent if the GP is more than or equal to 3.3 and less than 3.5 then very good if the GP is 2.5 or more but less than 3 is good and the GP is if it is more than or equal to 2 and less than 2.5 fair and if it is less than 2 it is poor now we can see here we have in the condition we have greater than equal greater than equal but we know in snap we don't have any option where we can do both of the greater than both of the operation greater than and equal this comparison together so either we can do this one by using two different operation two different command and take the or but there can be another solution and we can use the not gate for example in this picture it is shown so the comparison can be a greater than b or equal can be work around this following way so i can say that a is less than b not that means the a will be of course equal or more than b so we are going to use this logic in our program and we'll find the solution so let us at first uh, read the student id and his gpa so we start our snap program by using when the flag clicked then i'm going to ask enter enter student id then i am going to make a variable and set the variable so the variable will, will be id and i am going to set the id to the answer now i am going to ask again the gpa so enter enter students GPA and I'm going to take the answer and make another variable GPA I'm going to set the answer to the GPA so I have got the GPA now I can write down the if else construct to get this the message so I'm going to use the not gate and as I said I can use this one less than a not gate so at first let us check let me bring the GPA because I need GPA again and again okay so I can say that if the GPA is less than 3.5 and not so I bring the not get here so the GP is that at first I want to make this one so the GPA is greater than or equal 3.5 so if I say GP is less than 3.5 and not that means the GP will be 3.5 or more so if this is true then I'm going to say excellent because here we have to show the message excellent so I just say excellent now if it is not true then 
I have to check this one. GP is more than or equal to 3.5 and less than 3.5. So already, if it is more than 3.5 or equal, then the message will be shown excellent. So I don't need to check again that the value is 3.5 or more. So I can just say the value is more than 3. Uh, sorry, not this one. The value is the value is less than 3 again the same concept I'm going to use it is here so the value is less than 3 and not that means the value will be more than 3 and 3.5 so I'm going to use couple of more if else because now in the else I have to check again another condition so I'm going to check this condition. If this is true, then the result, the message will be very good. So I, I show the very good message here. So uh, I can show the very good. All, uh, let me show you all capital as shown in the question okay now again i have to check this condition which is the gpa if gpa is more than 3.5 less than 3 or more than or equal to 2.5 so again i use the same concept i'll check the gpa is less than 2.5 and not get So I bring another if else to compare this one. Now, if this 2.5 or more, the message I have to show is good. So I show the message by the say command. Good. Now, if it is not happened, then I have to check. So this is done. I have to check is the GPA is. 2.5 or more so for that I need another if construct if else and I will use the same concept GP is less than 2 and not so if it is true then my message will be fair otherwise poor so here I can say fair or I have to show the message poor so this will be the answer so let us run this pro program so the ID I can put any ID then enter students GPA so if I say 3.6 or 3.5 or 6 excellent I run again so enter any ID student GPA for example if I say 2 the result is fair which we can see here then if I say the student ID is this and the GPA is 1 then 4 so you can see that this program is working for all the inputs